This is what we're making today. Julienne Guoba. This is one day old rice. With it, we're gonna mix one egg, black pepper, salt, and chili powder. We're gonna give this a good mix with our hands, ensuring that the egg and the spices coat all of the rice. I forgot to record it, but I also added in one tablespoon of all-purpose flour. Once mixed in a semi-hot wok, we're gonna add in our rice. With a ladle, we're gonna press down the rice until it's into a shape of a bowl. We want to press the rice down as thin as possible without it cracking, just like this. We're now gonna turn up the heat to medium and start adding in a hot oil on the side of the wok. During this process in the wok, we're trying to crisp the outside of the rice. As we pour more oil into the wok, the rice will eventually be submerged, causing it to be deep fried. We're gonna deep fry this for about 5 minutes or until the outer layer is crisp. We're then gonna pour the oil out into another pan. Don't throw the oil away, we're gonna use it again in a minute. Once we've discarded all the oil, we're then gonna throw the rice into a bowl. At this point, the outer crust has been formed. Now, we're going to deep fry the inner crust. Using the same oil, we're going to heat it up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit and then pour it into our rice. We're going to deep fry it into this bowl for about 2 minutes. And then after 2 minutes, we're simply going to discard the oil and then set this aside. This is Spam. We're going to cut this in half and then cut it into slices. While I cut the spam and all my vegetable and garnishes, this is why I remind you to smash that like button and hit that notification bell for new videos. And if you really like what you see, hit the subscribe button, it's at the bottom right of your screen. And guys, if you guys are looking for written recipes with detailed instructions, check out my webpage at chefmar.ca. Here you will find all my Genshin Impact recipes. Also, if you guys want to help fund my recipes, check out my Patreon page at patreon.com slash chefmar. Every dollar helps me just a little bit to pay for these ingredients. Once we've cut up all our ingredients, we're now going to make our sauce. In a pan, we're going to throw in some garlic and saute it for about 30 seconds. Now, my pan here was extremely hot and I did end up burning a little bit of the garlic and chili flakes, so don't get your pan as hot as mine, okay? Once we sauteed our garlic and chili flakes, we're gonna add in an eighth of a cup of ketchup mayonnaise or sweet soy sauce, a quarter cup of hoisin sauce, an eighth of a cup of oyster sauce, and half a cup of cornstarch slurry. We're simply gonna give this a good mix and then bring it to a boil. And once it comes to a boil and the cornstarch has thickened the sauce, it's done. Using a spoon, we're simply going to pick out all the stuff that I burned on top of the sauce and then take it out. And it's still good. Now, in an extremely hot wok, we're going to throw in our Spam and Shiitake mushrooms. We're going to give it a little tossy toss for about 3 minutes and then add in our sauce. Once we add in our sauce, we're simply going to bring it to a boil Give it a toss, and that's it, and let's get ready to play.
first we're gonna try out this rice. Listen to this. As you can hear, it was nice and crispy. Now, just a quick lesson for you guys if you didn't know, Guo Ba is not only the stove god, but it actually means scorched rice in Chinese, and that's what we just made here. What I made here is actually a legit Chinese dish, where they use Spam to serve with the Guo Ba. As for the taste, I mean, it's actually really quite good. Spam with the Guo Ba and the sauce, mm. Give me this and a nice refreshing drink, oh my gosh. Anyways, that's it for this episode. If you guys like what you see, hit the like button. And if you guys have any suggestions on what should cook next, please post in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe.